Hello. What I thought I'd do today is show you some scripting techniques for the use of, with notes. Because you may or may not know, but you can't attach scripts to notes, which makes using them as quest targets particularly annoying. So I'm just going to show some little workaround methods. So first up, you'll want to create a note. So I'm going to find a note. I'm going to use this one because it has a model. Make sure the text is checked. Change, it's at, change the ID to, to anything as long as it's unique. My note. Change the name to note and change what is written here. This is a note. So your note's, your note's created. Okay. And hit yes to create new form. Then I've already made a quest up here that will run with this note quest. Oh yes, see here it is. My quest, it's got two stages, 10 and 20. So we're going to assume that quest 10 has, is to get note, stage 10, like this. And I'm going to write a little script. Script name, SCN, note script 1. Um, it will also be advisable not to give your note an ID with zero 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 or any numbers in front of it because scripts can get confused by them that works with anything for scripting I've mentioned that a few times in my comments but I haven't mentioned it I thought I'd actually mention it in the video but you probably shouldn't use numbers in in your in your scripts okay so we're gonna write begin game mode so this will run all the time and now this, I'm gonna do an optional thing but uh, it, so we could you could either do if get stage note quest equals ten. You could put that in beforehand if you wanted to, to only run once the quest had begun. Or you could do you know is greater than or equal to ten. You know that kind of thing. But what I'm just going to do is show you what will happen. Begin game mode if player dot get has note my note, and that was the idea of my note, equals one. When we're going to set stage note quest, which is the idea of my quest, 20. Then we're going to hit end if n. Make sure to save that as a quest script. Now we're going to find note quest and attach the script but we just wrote note script one so basically that will check if you have the note and if you do have the note it will set stage 20 which will be the next stage of your quest after the quest has begun or basically whatever stage you want to be set once you pick up the note which in this stage is 20 which I haven't made any objectives for but um, now I'll show you a different possibility which is going to involve me going into the world. This can be done in an interior or an exterior. I'm just using an exterior because I want to, basically. <sighs> Sorry about that. And then you got to wait for it to load. And I'm going to go to Springvale. The home of my mods. Yes to all, if that pops up. Now we're going to find the note. There it is. Only my gecko's is frozen. There it is. And click and drag it into the world. See, it looks like a hollow disk because I selected it to look like one. And I just hit F to make it drop to the ground. So now we're going to go back into this script name, note script 2. This time we're going to go begin on trigger enter player and do if player dot get item, no, player dot get has note, my note equals 1. Set stage note quest twenty 
end if end. Now these methods this should be saved as an object script. You should only use one of the three methods I'm going to show you, but this is just for your preference. Now we're going to draw a trigger around the note. Give it a new ID. Note trigger. Don't give it a name. And then we're going to look for the note script two there. And make sure your trigger covers the note. So basically that script will run while the player is inside the trigger, where the note also is. And that should be okay. I think that should work. If that doesn't if it I'm only theorizing this should work. If this doesn't work you may have to enter and relieve the trigger. Or just surround your note with a trigger. Like, you know, put a trigger here and then another one, another one, another one. I don't know. That should theoretically work. Um, if that one doesn't use one of my other methods, I'm going to show you another method of getting the note. We're going to go to misguide him. We're going to look up book. And we're going to get this pre war book and hit edit. And just call it pre war book 2. And I'm going to write here note, set its weight to 0, mark it as a quest item. Yes. Now click and drag pre war 2 book. Yes, that's okay. It's only a quest item. But that just comes up to stop you messing around with the game's actual files. There's the book. There it is. So now we can go SCN. I'll just call it book script. Begin on add player. Player dot add item. My note one. Set stage note quest twenty. End. So basically what that script does is when you pick up the book, the notes will be added to your inventory that you want to be the quest target. And then, don't forget to select the right script that we just wrote for the book. Then, once you you'll pick up a book, the note will be added to your inventory and the quest stage that you wanted that note to set will be set. So those are just multiple methods that you can use. I don't know, I had an interesting idea. Double click this trigger. And instead of this, instead of enter, write leave. There we go, and now we'll just make this. Yeah, that should be okay. So basically, if we, once the player leaves this trigger, that script will run instead of enter. So you'll pick up a note, walk away, then it'll trigger, that'll be a bit, that might work better. Again, use one of the three methods I've shown you here, but that should all work out. That should be fine, to be honest. That should work. Any of those three methods will work, as long as you only use one of them. Now, I am beginning to run out of ideas for get tutorials. I've got a list here, and I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine left and some of them aren't very good. So if you have something you want me to do as a video, leave a comment or send a personal message or something, and I will do it if I know how. I don't know how to do New Vegas Companion Wheels yet, but I'm looking into learning how to do it, so I won't be able to do any of those if that's something you want. You'll have to look somewhere else. And also, tomorrow, which is Friday the 29th, I don't know, I'm going away for five days until next Wednesday. So during that time, I won't be posting any videos, replying to any comments or to any personal messages during that time because I'll have no internet or access to my computer or anything. So I'm going camping, so you won't, I just won't be able to get back to you if you do have, if you do suggest anything or have any questions. Oh shit, I didn't want to save that. I don't want you save it, but I won't save it because I never save my my tutorial ESPs. Anyway, hopefully you found that helpful and. Yeah, bear in mind, but I won't be here to answer any questions, but still feel free to send me suggestions for Get Tutorials, because I'm running out of ideas. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.